Hello, you guys. It, it's uh, it's Team Head Smash here. I am sorry, but I'm gonna have to cancel the series. My webcam is messed up to where I can only record only 10 minutes of footage, and I just have to cancel it because I can't do two levels. And well, I can't do two levels in just like 10 minutes because that just I had to get MLG in order to do that. But I got in W3 back recently, and I've been playing a lot. As you can see, I'm using the RSAS with a cog sight. I've been... Hold on, guys. I have to position the camera to where you guys can see it. But, um... I will... I can provide you this. I go... I go ham with this gun. Like I don't go like super beast, but I do get I do get a lot of kills with the R SAS. <laughs> Most of the time I would use a scope on this, but since I was playing free for all, I thought I'm gonna be getting to a lot of close quarters engagement, so I thought I should use a uh cog sight. By the way you guys, my gun is only one rank away from getting the on camo. I, like I said, I am going to be more active on YouTube, I'm going to be posting more videos, so, please, let, let your friends don't actually have a YouTube account, or that do have a YouTube, not actually, but, like, well, you know what I'm talking about, let them know about my channel, and whatnot, and besides, you guys, I'm probably just going to cancel the series anyway, I mean, nobody's even going to watch my videos properly. And yes, I do a little bit of camping here, but like, hey, this was a this was a big spot for the moment because I was camping here, and I also got a specialist bonus. And just in case you guys ask me what prestige am I, I sadly am only fourth prestige because I left off at third when my NW3 broke. So yeah, and my school will start back. I live in Hazard, Kentucky. Oh, I'm sorry, I didn't know the camera, you know, was messing up. Right there should be good. But like, um, I'm in eighth right now. It's pretty hard, but it's it's a fun year. Like it's hard and fun at the same time. I've had to miss today and you know yesterday. But I am happy because I got to work. I got to work really hard on my R SAS. When I reach my prestige, when I get my fit. No, fifth prestige, yes, I'm going to, um, I'm going to play, I'm going to use my prestige token Enemy to keep back to the RSS, because I really, am really having a lot of fun using the RSS now. And as you can see, I'm using my MP9, because I wanted to get the hip fire thing, for the, uh, steady aim pro version, uh, of his perk, because, like, I kind of lost my train of thought, but, um, oh yeah, because, like, I've gotten to a lot of situations with the RSAS from, like, some guy sneaks up in front of me and I don't have time to react. And, like, I just... I need that because I can draw my gun quicker and stuff. And this guy does intend to get me. And I was going to say something, but I don't want to copy Wicked Shrapnel, uh, you know, Dark Corner, McDougal, and stuff, and can't be McCamp for Pants. But... What gave me the idea to actually make a video about me using the RSS was because um, I saw a video of him of Wicked Stratnal. If you do not know him, go check out his channel. Um, he makes a lot of hilarious videos. Um, he made a video called he made has a series called This Gun Fucking Sucks. And what I didn't like about one of them was the RSS. I mean, this gun is really not that bad. I mean, I know that he says that if you say this is not bad, then stop calling for you stop trying for unicorns and stuff, but, I mean, like, seriously, this gun's not that gun if you have a cock sight on it. I would have extended mag on, but, like, it's really hard to use this gun to have a cock sight on because of all the sway that's on it. So stability for this gun, I'm just going to go out and say it is a perfect proficiency for using it. And as you can see, I have the red digital camo. Because I saw, because in that video about Wicked Shrapnel and stuff, uh, he, like, if he can't win a free-for-all with guns that he thinks is bad, he 
ask his subscribers to um, do, to do it, but he actually got one. A guy went 30 and uh oh with an R sass and he got Moab in a free for all. It was pretty awesome. That's what made me start using it. I mean, like seriously, like I was really surprised on how good that guy did with the R sass. And one of my friends is also is also a, a really big R sass user. During her uh, third prestige, second prestige, first prestige, and unfortunately she prestige, the RSAS was the first gun she got gold, because she really likes the gun. During the demo of NWC, I'm pretty sure there was one, she constantly kept using the RSAS, and she just really grown to like it. What I find so awkward is that look at it, I mean, it looks not exactly similar, but looks pretty similar to the um, MSR. I now just noticed that. And he's probably definitely having one of those WTF moments that one guy right there. He's probably thinking, what the crap, There's, that's a total mod. There's no way he shot me that fast. Because the RSS can shoot at a total of 100, I mean 1,000 and 200 rounds a minute. That's about as fast as a normal assault rifle can shoot, so if you have a really fast trigger finger, you could turn this thing into like a extremely strong uh, semi-auto assault rifle just like the MK-14. And basically, you guys, just how would you would want to use this gun is just like the MK-14. Put a cog size stability on it because it already has a 20 round magazine. The lo that's the largest round or the largest magazine in the game and like and it's just really good just like treat it as an MK14 with a scope on it and when you get the cock sight put it on but I will warn you guys the stability perk is or the stability proficiency is the last one you unlock you unlock at 27 I think um, so it's gonna be kinda hard so the one that will get you by enough you know is gonna be something like the kick proficiency or something like that, yeah. But like this video is getting close to an end, but but like yeah. The RSAS is a really, really good gun. It's like the it's like a something that can give you time if you don't like guys, if you're new at Call of Duty, just seriously, if you get when you get this gun Get a cog sight for it and get the steady aim uh, pro version because it's really good. Because I tried the, because like seriously, I like got so many kills when I had the steady aim pro perk on with the RS house with the cog sight. Like I went like 42 to like 27. I wasn't camping at all. I was actually rushing a little bit, like staying in one spot getting like two or three kills and moving up to another spot and controlling that point. I was basically just being a team player and me and my friend, me and two of my friends, uh, we, we are really, the girl that I told you about, she is a real big RSS user. Um, what was so funny was that she was using the RSS and I was using it. It was like when I first started using it. And one of my other friends had an M4A1 and he recently got it gold camo because he hasn't played in W3 forever. So, um, we told him to go on the bomb and we'll cover him. And, turns out, our sniper work actually got it. And I've only been using this gun for two days and I've already got it. Red Tiger came off. I was actually very surprised. I bet my friend would be very surprised I already got it. Red Tiger camo or Red Digital camo. They should have just called this Red Digital camo because, like, seriously, the only thing that comes close to looking like Tiger camo is the blue camo. So, yeah, this video is just about to end. He's definitely having one of those WTF moments right there. And watch this. Noob tube. See right there, that's about as fast as you can shoot it. But there's my camera tire first place, and sadly I was the last kill. I told everybody, even the noob tuber, that that was a good match. I really did enjoy playing it. And I went 27 to 15 with it in this match. So, to, and wow, no wonder I did good. I, I was the highest prestige in the lobby. But most of the people wouldn't prestige. But, like, yeah, this has been Team Head Smash. And I'm signing off, and I will see you guys next week. Peace out.